Good morning, everyone. This is Dawn at Twin Hearts Ablaze. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being on the way. Thank you for showing up fully as who you are to the best of your ability in every moment. And that's what this video is about. I have had um, a series of three downloads, I suppose you would call them, started. I had one, um, I believe it was Monday night, Tuesday morning, um, and a very powerful, perhaps one of the most powerful downloads from spirit energetically that I have ever received last night. Um, that would have been the evening of the 19th, and I'm recording this on the 20th. I don't know how long it'll take to upload, so I'm in a different place. So we'll see how quickly I can upload that. And then the third one was uh, early, early hours this morning, thus <laughs> look tired again. Um, it's been really huge energetically for me. Everything I've received um, the um, 19th and 20th um, of July. And this is not new for me. This information even is not new for me. But I am telling you with all honesty and integrity that the level of um, the energy that I, I can often um, feel from the, um, uh, it's hard to describe, but the qualities of the energetic um, pack packages um, that come to me from the higher realms and sometimes from specific um, angels, archangels, and sometimes uh, just, you know, from, it feels like it's just <laughs> like I'm putting some kind of funnel and I can, I can discern, I have learned to discern from the um, quality of that um, and the, the, how I experience it. I've learned that there is a linkage with the, um, what plays out in, in the larger, sometimes global events and sometimes just collective sometimes it's in you know in the uh, twin flame sacred partnership collective so what i'm trying to say here is that this i feel is in, incredibly important and i'm going to try to articulate it the best i can i was given um you know three key messages to share with you and um, i'm going to probably refer to a few um scriptures because that feels important to me um and and then i'm going to have i hope a heart to heart uh, brief with Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. So that's what this video is. Um, a quick note to say thank you um, so much to um, those of you who've reached out for a soul shower blessing. Um, and uh, you can find more information about that on my website. So here goes. All right. Um, let me see if I can articulate this to you. So we are coming into a season of resolution, I've talked about that before, and the resolution is going to be um, come through a series of events and three key messages I was re I was receiving um, that will be quite intense for all of us, all of humanity, um, and for those of us who have um, been called to the sacred partnership path. Um, they're already within those of us in that community. There have been, um, you know, two um, basic um, ways of dealing with that knowing of who we are. I don't think I need to spell that out for you. I think that, you know, each of you can, you know, discern for yourself where you've been in terms of that truth for yourself. And um, there is there is going to be a reordering is what I would I those that's my word reordering rapid and uh, quick in terms of pace and revolutionary in terms of your own life and how that's going to feel. So um, let's start with the word I was shown um, it you know I was I'm just gonna be honest about what I was shown. I was shown um, individual souls, um, including many of us on this journey, and this just like earth-shattering catastrophe. And the word catastrophe came as part of some other things I was receiving. And so the word catastrophe is an event causing great and often sudden damage or suffering. A disaster. We call it a disaster here. Dis disaster. I saw somewhere recently, and I'm sorry I don't remember the source, but disaster. Disaster. Dis, you know, meaning negating, aster, meaning the stars. What about that, you know? I often talk about your soul um, star, your soul's truth and radiance, that's an acronym, star. And, and how, where have you 
been dishonoring your own soul's truth and radiance, which is of God, which is given to you by spirit, which is the gift of God. I'm going to pause for just a moment. I'm so sorry about the interruption. Okay, I've turned that off, and I hope I don't get interrupted again. I've, um, By the way, I felt um, major um, attempts at attacks when I started to make this video, so I'm going to stay with it, um, and I feel it's that important. Um, so um, I was talking about catastrophe and the meaning of catastrophe and disaster. Think about that. Just think about those words themselves. Um, you know, also c uh, catastrophe, when I looked up the meaning, it, it's um, linked to the denouement in a long unfolding drama, which immediately aligned with what I was shown, which is the story of humanity. If you look at my, um, I have a thing I created called the story of life and in three acts. And I'm gonna try my best to, to somehow find a way to share that again. It's in pieces and um, but if you if you look at the sweep of the collective human story there is no question that we have come a long way and that we are at the have been at that peak and the story has to go somewhere from here and so denouement if you're not familiar with that word and denouement is a linked with the meaning of catastrophe and then a denouement of a drama um, and in terms of like classical Greek tragedies and, and, and stories that we are familiar with in our time, you know, movies, the final part, it's the, that end, it's the resolution, it's the end of the play, it's the end of the movie, it's the end of the story. And, and what happens? Well, all of these strands of the plot come together at that point and everything is explained and suddenly it all makes sense. We are at that point right now, right now. And um, the end, tail end of July, and uh, into the first, the, I'll say the last week of July, the first week of August is the setup for the denouement, and it unfolds quickly, quickly from there. Um, so, um, what I was given um, were three. Uh, this was going to be a season of intensity, and that there were uh, 